I'm Dr. Patrick Arnold coming to you from Mainland Wellness. And over the next several weeks, we're going to be talking about something called the seven pillars of exercise, which is why I have this ball in my hand right now. In our office, we like to tell our patients that motion is life. And what that means is, the more active you maintain your lifestyle, the less chances you're going to be at risk for things like cardiovascular disease, stroke, type 2 diabetes, chronic health conditions such as different types of cancer. In fact, you can reduce the likelihood of, of, of developing different types of cancer just by maintaining an active lifestyle. One study published in the American Journal of Medicine said that women who exercised one to two hours a week with brisk walking reduced their likelihood of developing breast cancer by 18%. That's pretty significant. There's a lot of other studies out there which you can Google yourself to find out the benefits of exercise. But here's the thing. You've got to get out of the chair and you've got to start moving. Nobody can make you do that. You've got to make a decision to do that yourself. And it's one of the most positive decisions you can make to benefit your health. So remember, motion is life. The longer you stay sedentary, the more likely somebody's going to come and start throwing dirt in your direction. Your body needs four basic components to have life. So if you look at my little graph over here, remember these graphs when you were a kid in school? Before computers, this is what we had, right? Bar graph, right? We have zero on this end, which I labeled cellular death. Not too nice, zero. 100% on this side, which I'm going to label full life expression. Anything you do that moves you from this side of the graph to this side of the graph is a positive thing. Remember, today we're talking about exercise. So if you don't exercise at all, you're moving this way. If you just start tomorrow going for a walk, you're going to move your graph in this direction. And then, of course, the more engaged you get with exercise, the further you're going to move yourself this way this way along. Exercise is only one pillar. That's the one we're talking about today. So remember, make a decision today to start increasing your activity levels tomorrow. Because you want to be moving this way, right? So remember, it's your future. Be there healthy. Thanks. We'll see you next time.